Good evening. Welcome back to RimWorld. I'm Modi Apparatus. We're in episode, I think, 9 now? Maybe 10? I don't even remember. Episode 10 is usually when things go very, very badly for, for me, though, it seems like. Uh, that's where the turning point in these series usually happens. We have enemies at the gate here. We have Kruger, who just took out this uh, ship part that crashed down here. Uh, heroically saved the colony, pretty much. Uh, but he is way far away from the rest of the team here, so I'm actually going to have to send him over here. Meanwhile, we have a bunch of unsuspecting guys in here who don't know what's been happening, so we're going to send them down to here and get them in position over here, and hopefully they can get there before the uh, pirates show up here. And hopefully the pirates are slowed down by this little thing here. We didn't do enough defenses right here. I feel like that wasn't enough. Um, this guy's going to get taken out. Hopefully he's got a weapon or something. He's got a Pila. All right, he should be taking these guys out, though, I think. Uh, meanwhile, there's way too many guys here. There's already way too many guys. I can see the problems that we're going to have here. Um, they're decided to kidnap who they can and leave. Well, who can they kidnap? Who are they getting? Oh, they're just going to take that guy? Okay. <laughs> Kruger, don't trouble yourself. They're not after us. Oh my god. Okay, let's undraft him. Let's undraft everybody. Oh my god. that luck We lucked out a lot there. Good lord, I thought that was the end of the colony right there. But well, we got pretty lucky that that one guy was just happened to be leaving the same time uh, our guys were running up. So uh, that's pretty great, actually. Uh, that reminds me, though, we do need to think about defenses here. So as I was going to say, um, before, not say before, but necessarily uh, I, I mentioned before, is that we're going to put in a bunch of uh, sandbags in through here. And that'll prevent guys from stopping in here, I believe. Uh, they shouldn't be able to fire when they're standing on top of sandbags. So we'll have to get out to the outside and there'll be a way where the, the turret can finally hit them is the idea there. So that's the plan for that. Now that we have that going, uh, we need somebody to run down and get that ship core here. This is a very, very valuable thing. And there's a lot of metal here too we want. Uh, this this centipede probably can be taken out too. Actually, I could have Kruger do that once he's up and running here. Um, let him rest for a little bit first. Though he's earned it. He's earned himself a little break. Oh, I really thought that was going to be the end of the colony there. Man, we got a, we got a reprieve for sure. Um, hopefully we can get back to some just, you know, normal like rebuilding stuff here now. And uh, make it through the winter. It is December 5th. 89 days since our arrival. We're gonna make it to day 100. I hope we make it to day 100. That'd be amazing. I don't know if I've ever made it that far before. I never really looked at, like, a cluster of cargo pods crashing nearby. Okay, that's right. There's this stuff here. So let's grab all that. Um, so, Kruger, what are you working on right now? He is repairing the turret. That's a very good thing. Let's worry about our defenses first, I guess. Yeah. And then we'll go to down and grab that AI core. We'll want that. I just don't want it to run off or anything like that. Because now we can actually start building the ship. Oh my god. Um, we can actually get off this planet, maybe. That would be a, that'd be a good goal for us to have. That's kind of the end of the game. We can do that. So, maybe we'll start... Uh, boy, who can we have it, even have do it now? Jono is our only one that can be really researching. Why is Brick so mad at us? He really doesn't want to join up. He's got imprisoned. He's got camp and fever. He's serious. Uh, let's actually give him a change of scenery here. Let's, um, let's, let's set this as set for colonists. And then we'll set this for prisoners. And we'll move him up there. See if he likes a change of scenery, maybe. He's been in here too long, maybe, is the problem. Um, that could be it. So we'll have somebody deal with him quick here. Meanwhile, Kruger is slowly meandering up to the bed. This guy's just gonna run free, I think, now. Actually. He's being, he's actually, he's, he's been, uh, broken. He's not even trying to escape here now. He doesn't want to join up with us, but he doesn't want to leave either. He likes the spacious interior. Let's see how he likes, uh, a little worse. Actually, you know what? He's actually close. I feel like he's close. If we put a light in here, I bet you he will join up. So let's set these for prisoners again. Let's set this for colonists. And I bet you if we put a light in there, he'll join up. So let's go furniture, lights. Not enough. That's fine. Um, okay, who's that, who's that for hauling? Can we get Jono down there to do this? Uh, let's get you hauling this. Prioritize hauling that, please. And then uh, Kruger should be working on building some stuff here, I hope. Meanwhile, we need to figure out where the coldest spots are. This is still negative 17 inside here. Like, I can understand why people are very uncomfortable with the whole thing here. So we'll get some heaters and stuff going in here very, very soon. Um... In the meantime, though, I should probably set this up as a cooler in here. So let's actually get a uh, cooler going right here. Not enough space. What does it need? 
I don't know what it's saying here. Cooler is an electrical device that fits into a wall and pushes cold air into a room. It is an exhaust port that generates a lot of heat. So actually, we could actually just do this. Space already occupied. Do we put it like a wall? I think maybe we put it like a wall. In place of a wall, let's try it on a wall. Yeah, it works there. So we need to put it on an actual conduit wall, I think. It's the only way to get it. Okay, so... What we could do is, once it's powered, we'll, this will be providing coldness for this, and this will be providing heat for this. We might be able to move this heater out of here and get reclaim that uh, that uh, warmth from that, maybe. It might be, end up too, being too hot in here, but that's fine. Um, yeah, probably warmer is going to make it grow faster. So, let's actually put in an order, then, to mine this out here. I'll do that. Okay. And we'll put conduit wall in there once we're uh, done mining that. And somebody, sh hopefully, 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 somebody will be able to uh, get him some metal. Kruger's got it. Kruger's on top of it. He's going to build that lamp. We can get brick on our side, and we have another colonist to help us out. And then we're going to be at capacity. Trade ship passing by, slave trader. Now that our mood's improved, we could sell off brick here for a lot of money if he doesn't want to join up here soon. People don't like it when you do that, though. It tends to uh, create some uh, mental mental uh, issues for the crew. Below loyalty for our threshold. I just don't know why he's not getting over the hump. His mood is almost all the way up here. He's convinced by the warden is super high. Sounds like a good place, yes. I agree. It sounds like a great place. We're doing so well here. Is Sergei actually a better cook now? He's a five. I don't think he can make the advanced meals yet still. Even though he's cooking like non-stop here. Alright, so somebody should build this light. Hopefully he's got enough metal here. How far is he going to have to run? Well, not too bad. Oh, not even all the metal. So that's perfect. Okay, we can get this guy a lamp in here. Maybe he'll uh, want to join up after he gets a nice lamp. Alright, go back to sleep. Somebody will finish that in the morning. Come on. Go through the night. Okay, let's uh, get... Can you work on this? No, not a constructor. Good. Okay, Kruger can work on it though. There, build it quick. There we go. Cool. So he should be happy about the light now. And my rendering just finished. <laughs> um, I like the multitask here. I like the multitask when I'm doing stuff here. Uh, so, what can we do to get this guy on our side? I don't even know. His thoughts, his negative thoughts are he's imprisoned, he ate off the ground. I guess we could put a table in there. And then cabin fever. I don't know how to help him with that. I desperately need to get outside. What can we do for that guy? If we get him outside, maybe he'll be okay. I mean, we'll put him out in the cold if we put him out here. Like, we should, like, give him a, a walk to the yard here. Should we just release him? Maybe we should just release him. Does he have anything good? That's the next question here. Let's just strip him. Let's see if he's got anything good. Here we go. See how you like that, buddy. He's got his clothes back. Oh, he's grabbed his clothes back. He's like, no, give him my shirt back. Oh, that was kind of demeaning here. I wonder if you wonder if his mood is affected by that. Eat off the ground, cabin fever in prison. No, nope, just mad about eating off the ground. Come on, buddy, you gotta join up. Man, okay, what can we do with this guy? Let's just release him. Let's release him. Let's, uh, prisoner release. There we go. You're free to go, man. You've, you, you've did your time. Get outside. There you go. And actually, if we, could, if we can get him outside for a minute here, he's freezing. Oh, wait, no, what we can do is rest him quick. <gasps> what if we rest him again quick? There we go. Arrest him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Got him. Okay, great. Now put him back in his cell. Oh, man. We might just hack the game a little bit here. I don't know. Might be a way to do this, but I'm not sure if that'll work. Just kidding. You're not released. Machito says no. Oh, God. I wish he's mad about that. Oh, but he's not mad about... Oh, man. But his mood is still up. This will work. This whole thing will work, actually. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, cool. He's going to freeze to death out there anyways, so we'll help him out. Let him, let him walk the yard a little bit here, and we'll, we'll bring him back in later. That's awesome. There's a lot of metal over here, apparently, that we're grabbing or something. Oh, they're grabbing the sandstone bricks, or whatever it was. I guess I said chunks are okay in here, but I'm not really okay with it anymore. So let's turn the chunks off. There's a dumping ground over here for those chunks, I think, or some someplace. I don't know. Um, we'll set this up as chunks in... Actually, what we should do is set this up as chunks in here. 
So uh, we'll zone this whole thing here for dumping. We'll do like this. Like that, and then we'll do a uh, D zone like right, like right in the middle of the room here, where people will stand. If this whole thing gets filled up with chunks, they'll uh, this will be uh, storage for bodies and corpses and chunks basically. And um, we'll pick, we'll make a better like doorway for our guys here eventually. For now, they're gonna have to climb over all the rocks and stuff to get out, but um, hopefully soon they won't have to worry about it too much. They're going to get all the metal and steel and all that. This this guy's still alive. I'm just gonna leave him. I don't think he'll come back to life. If he does, I'll I'll eat my hat. I don't know. I don't just I'll 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 go kill him. If if he comes back alive, I'll go kill him. How about that? Oh, shh. well, I didn't intend for that to happen. Um, let's cancel this whole thing here because I did not mean for that to happen. For I should have known that they would have done that though. Uh, we need to put the conduit wall back in there now. Like so. And actually, this was going to be rooms here anyway, so that's, that can be mined out. That's fine. And we'll make this a little bit bigger eventually, too. We should stockpile a lot of food, though, for that cooler. I think that's, uh, we have, like, muffalo to hunt and that kind of thing. Now that winter is upon us, we'll finally have enough food. Should be alright, though. And it's people building the condo wall now? They should. I bet you somebody, like, locks themselves inside this room here. It's happened. It's happened. Kruger, Kruger put himself in the wall last time this happened, so maybe he will do it again. Uh, and then we need to finish the conduit wall up through here, too. Uh, that's going to be kind of a, a big project, too, I think. We need a lot more metal, basically, is the, the story here. Um, and actually, let's put the orders in here to mine this out, because there is some metal here worthwhile. And we'll deconstruct right here. Even though that will disconnect the thing here, we'll, we'll just do it for now. So somebody should be working on that. Wherever Kruger might be. Probably hauling things, yeah. See, it slows him down quite a bit through there. That'll give us more time. And then what, basically what I'll do is put a, an external doorway here for guys to get back in and out easily with a bunch of like powered doors or something. Uh, and that should... Oh, we need a door over here though too. We should put, probably put a door back in. Steel door right there. Cool. And then we'll be all set with our defenses. And we also need another turret in here too, I think. Uh, would be another good step. Well, that's pretty basic, pretty simple. My first one I've actually completed, I think, on the, 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 the series here. All of my series. I think it's the first one I've actually completed. Uh, okay, let's get another mining operation. Oh, that's already, it's good. Okay, let's get all that mined out. Once it's all mined out, we'll replace this wall with another kind of wall here. Might have been a waste, but... Uh, well, we probably should not do metal walls here anymore, because this is steel kind of walls. We could probably save a little bit of steel by using the, the rocks that we have, the brick, the stones and stuff. So we'll keep that in mind, too. Uh, okay, so now that we're at the back, we'll have somebody use that up here for us. Grab all that. And where is he going? We're getting the second turn. Oh, we did. Nice. Second steel mortar is good to go. Uh, let's... Uh-oh. What do we have now? A group of pirates from the Whip Group have arrived in drop pods nearby. It looks like they want to besiege the colony. Jump to the location. Okay, so we got another siege on our hands. But this time we're much more well prepared. Oh man, there's so many of them though. Um, okay, let's get let's do the same thing we did last time basically. Jono is gonna be our sniper. Uh, he'll walk up and see if he can shoot some of them down from a distance. Let's see where they want to set up though first. They're setting up over here. Okay, cool. So let's have uh jo let's have Sergey man this mortar here. And then we'll have Machinto, who's another good shot. Actually, Machinto's a better shot than Jono was. But well, Jono, why don't you man this, uh, this mortar here? And then Machinto, I'm gonna draft you, buddy. And you get the honor of being our sniper today. Let's head you over here. Okay, cool. There's our supplies. But if we can actually start shooting them from here already, we'll be in good shape here. Let's take them out. All right, get you right here. Not what we wanted to happen. Oh my god, okay, he needs to get out of there. Okay, he's already hit a couple times. Alright, so they're they're aware of him this time. Um, it's gonna be a little bit different than last time, I think. But this time we have two mortars, 
so maybe we'll be able to handle it. All right, he's been injured. Where's his, where, what's his health like? Oh, he's left lung is in his right leg. All right, this time I think we'll be okay. And if we make sure these target the uh, the mortar they're putting down here, and this guy would target the other one here. That force target for this one here. They're gonna have two mortars on us, and they're already up and running. Oh man, we really gotta take those things out. They're already manned. Oh my god, we're gonna be in big, big trouble here. Oh, they're taking out our fire. Oh, they're taking out our solar panels. It's gonna burn. You can't put it out, buddy. Yeah, it's already gone. Put out the rest of it before that everything else burns. Shinto, why don't you get some rest here? And then you guys, I'm gonna bring you over here to break the siege again. We need somebody over there to do it. And Kruger, why don't you come with? Actually, yeah, repair the wires, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. Before, before we do anything else. Okay, now. Oh, we need a gun. I'm not sending you over there with this knife. Uh, let's do a LMG if we have it. Where did it go? Alright, let's do an M16 then. Alright, come over here. Come with your comrades. Over to this location over here. Alright, you guys are gonna hold up right there. Wait for Kruger to show up, I think. And, uh, Sergey, why don't you get right here? And Jonah, why don't you get right here? Jonah's gonna take the brunt of this force here. Oh, okay, here we go. Jonah's in trouble here. Uh, Jonah, why don't you get back? And where did Sergey go? Or Kruger? Why don't you go right here, actually? I have him in the wrong spot. I'm gonna have Sergey right here, actually. Get him, Sergey. Oh my god, we're taking some serious damage here. Oh, okay, time to run, time to run. They got a good defense. They got a really good defense. Alright, here we go. They got guys coming at us. Let's get back out of here. Run back, run back, run back. They're coming after us. We want to kind of go them into coming after us. That's the big thing. Alright, is everybody else good? Man, we didn't break the siege, though. And the mortar... The oh, wait, we got one. <gasps> we got one of the mortars broken. Awesome. Okay, so this one's damaged, too. We can get that other one broken. Let's get a bit of a rest in here. Kruger's gonna provide some uh, healing for everybody. Some TLC. Somebody's about to starve here. Jono's about to starve. And we're losing power again because we have the solar panel is actually doing a whole lot for us here. So let's put in order to uh, build that again. Oh, because the power is not from coming over here anymore. That's part of the problem too. Um, we need to get the mixture of this power kind of through here then too. And who's rested? Kruger's gonna work on that. Shinto, what are you doing? No, 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 no. This is gonna be the highest priority for corpses. Critical. And this is just preferred. Or normal. Yeah, normal's fine. Shinto, why don't I draft you? And have you work the mortar again? Oh, they took a wall out. Oh, man! That's not good. Our defenses will not work well if that wall is missing there. So let's do a structure. Uh... Sandstone blocks. Nope, not there. Right here. That's not going to be good. If that breaks, that's going to be very, very not good. Let's take a uh, hauling as a lower priority now. And uh, constructing as a higher priority for these guys. Alright, we really need to take that mortar out somehow. And actually, it looks like this stuff is not being able to be used by them. Alright, they missed us again. Mashinta, how you doing? Overall, not too shabby. Fire again in a couple seconds. Get him. Oh, come on. Alright, I'm gonna send him off of this then. Undraft him. I'll rotate somebody else in now. Who's ever the most rested? Alright. Sergey, why don't you uh, come down and man this mortar here? Be nice if we could actually hit something with this, guys. And where's Kruger? I need you to make sure you prioritize refixing this wall here. And Mashinto, it looks like you're rested now. Not quite, but still, I'm gonna actually. You're still working, I guess. So Jono, how are you doing? 
He's good. Okay, I'm gonna draft him and put him on this other mortar here. We really need these things to, to hit. Have any hope here. Luckily they haven't rebuilt the other mortar that they that they damaged. They're all sleeping on the floor though. So close. Oh now we're now we're getting it. Okay. They're beginning their assault. Okay, good. That's great. Um let's get you guys over here then. Let's get uh where's our other guys? Where's our other guys? Shinto, you didn't rest yet, did you? Oh man, you're gonna be in trouble. All right, let's get you over here. And Kruger, get that wall made right on time. And Kruger, I need you to uh, over here. And then Mashinto, actually, I'm gonna just put you on a sleeping right now. Um, so go sleep. Here we go. Here we go. Here it comes. Here it comes. Here we go. Let's play it slow. Here we go. Get him. Get him. Get him. All right, one down. This guy's got incendiary, which is, which is not gonna be great. They're fleeing already. Okay, we got another one down. Oh, okay, we got one. We can capture one right now. Awesome. And did Brick join up with us? Whatever happened to him? Whatever happened to Brick? Uh, I think we actually uh might have let him go accidentally. All right, let's you guys go work then. And actually, actually, Sergey, put this fire out right now. Oh, he's going to fight it. Good. Man, if we had a, a way of blocking them to get away from getting away, that'd be amazing. Oh boy! All right, so uh, capture that guy, bring him over. I guess, I guess, because we told him to get, he was released. We couldn't bring him back. Uh, so that's that's unfortunate. I guess we can't keep him here. Um, I was really hoping we could. Um, we need to get this fixed here next. Orders fix this up. A little bit of repair from the uh, old, the old thing we just dealt with, the old uh, siege here. There's some- oh, there's a guy over here. Oh, we can rescue another one. Okay, let's actually, uh, have this guy get rescued then, too. Um, once- once Sergei's done rescuing that guy, I'll have Kruger actually- are you okay to do this? Did you guys not rescue him? Oh, there's a guy that needs rescue over here. Is anybody handling that? Nope, no one- no one actually grabbed him. What? Did he just die? Where did he go? Anybody? I thought there was a guy here. Oh, maybe they grabbed him. As they're fleeing. Well, Levin the chemist, we'll grab him. So, K Sergey, no, Kruger. Uh, well, I'm gonna have you go rescue him. And he is from the colony. Okay, let's grab him. And, uh, is he already dead? No, he's already dead. Never mind, don't worry about him. He fr they freeze quick out there. Maybe that's the problem, is that people are just freezing quick. So I think it's going to do it for this episode. This might be a little bit shorter one than before, but a lot happened this episode, so I don't mind it at all. I'll be back for another one very soon. As you can see, the colony is going to be continuing. We'll have a lot of uh, work to do fixing things up here, but um, it shouldn't take too much work, and we'll be back in better than ever very, very soon. So I've been Modi. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you back next time for more. Have a good night.